Happy first day of spring. Five weird traditions to welcome the vernal equinox 2017. Today, countries in the northern hemisphere will shift from winter into spring. Here's everything you need to know about the vernal equinox 2017. Spring is in the air, and today sees the vernal equinox, which officially marks the beginning of the spring season in the northern hemisphere. If you live in the UK, that means the daffodils are blooming, blossom is on the trees, Easter is coming, and lambing season will soon be getting underway. Here's everything you need to know about the first day of spring. Why does the vernal equinox happen? The equinox occurs because of the tilt of the earth in relation to the sun. This is what causes the seasons. The Earth's tilt is 23.5 degrees relative to the plane of its orbiter and means that, although one revolution of the planet takes 24 hours, it's different depending on the time of year. During the summer time, the northern hemisphere is tilted towards the sun, so we get longer days as more light falls on this part of the planet. In the winter time it's the southern hemisphere that gets the majority of the light. Equal night. On the spring equinox, the Earth hits the turning point in its orbit where neither the north or the south poles are tilted towards the sun. As a result, the sun spends a roughly equal amount of time above and below the horizon at every location on the Earth, so night and day are about the same length. The word equinox is Latin for equal night. Meteorologists use it as the official turning point in the seasons because, Although it can vary from year to year, it allows for the most accurate record keeping. When is the spring equinox? This year, the vernal, or spring, equinox takes place on Monday, March 20th. After this point, the days will get longer and the nights will get shorter until the summer solstice on June 21st, when the pattern will reverse. How is the spring equinox celebrated? Equinoxes and solstices mark key stages in the astronomical cycle of the Earth. The March equinox has long been celebrated as a time of rebirth in the Northern Hemisphere. Many cultures celebrate spring festivals and holidays around the March equinox, like Easter and Passover. However, there are also a few more unorthodox celebrations, some of which date back thousands of years. If you're looking for a way to mark the occasion, here are five weird traditions to give you inspiration. 1. Balance an egg. There is an ancient Chinese belief that you can stand an egg on its end on the first day of spring. The theory goes that, due to the sun's equidistant position between the poles of the earth at the time of the equinox, special gravitational forces apply. This is, of course, nonsense. But it does still make for a fun party game and you can save your eggs to paint on Easter Day. 2. Throw some colored powder. Holi is an ancient Hindu festival celebrating the victory of good over evil. It takes place each year around the time of the vernal equinox. Known as the Festival of Colors, it is celebrated by tossing vibrant colored powders onto each other and dancing in the streets. This year, Holi starts on Sunday, March 12th. But if you've got some leftover powder, why not save it to brighten up your day on the 20th? 3. Wear a shamrock. The symbolic plant of the equinox in Druidry is the trefoil or shamrock, which is also customarily worn on St. Patrick's Day. The three leaves shaped like hearts were associated with the triple goddess of Celtic mythology, otherwise known as the Three Morgans. The shamrock is thought to be symbolic of the regenerative powers of nature. 4. Plant Seeds The spring equinox is symbolic of rebirth, renewal, and growth, and in ancient Italy, it was traditional for women to plant seeds in the gardens of Adonis on this day. The custom persists in Sicily, where women plant seeds of grains, lentils, fennel, lettuce or flowers, in baskets and pots. When they sprout, the stalks are tied with red ribbons and the flowers are placed on graves on Good Friday, symbolizing the triumph of life over death. 5. Visit an ancient monument. 
Many of the world's ancient monuments were built as astrological calendars, to map the movement of the sun over the course of the year. The equinox is therefore a great time to visit these monuments, as they are often aligned to make the most of the sun's unique position in the sky. At Stonehenge in Wiltshire, the sun can be seen rising precisely between two stones, while at Chiquitza in Mexico, the rising sun transforms one edge of the giant pyramid into a blazing serpent, representing the Mayan god Kukulkan. Google Doodle Google is celebrating the spring equinox 2017 with one of its animated doodles. The doodle shows a mouse waking up from hibernation in its underground burrow, and rushing outside to pick a daffodil to put in a jar. In the southern hemisphere, where today marks the first day of autumn, Google's doodle shows the mouse wearing a scarf, and hopping through fallen leaves to get back to its burrow. When it gets inside, it hops up on a cotton bobbin and takes a drink from a steaming cup of tea.